Attention, the following video is going to totally kick ass. If you enjoy any of it and or have a large penis, please click the like button below. Enjoy. Hello everyone, I'm KR Speedy and welcome back to my South Park The Stick of Truth Let's Play. And today we are going to be taking a break from the main mission of this game to do a side quest I've really been wanting to do. And that side quest will be Man Bear Pig. So we're going to help Al Gore out and do everything for him. But first I want to go over to Kingdom Koopa Keep. Which stands with three K's, which is great. Thanks, Cartman. Glad I'm fighting for you. But we are going over there, hopefully, to buy some new weapons. I want to see what is the best weapon I can get. I want to sell a bunch of stuff, see how much money I can get. Oh! Oh my God! They came out of nowhere. There was a huge earthquake, and then and then there was burning in my yard. Didn't you hear about it? It's all over the news. Here, look. And that a large earthquake and several fires in the South Park area last night woke many residents from their sleep. Here with the report is a midget in a bikini. <laughs> Tom, government workers here are assuring everyone nothing out of the ordinary has happened. They claim that the only reason huge tents have gone up to cover this area is to mask the construction of a new Taco Bell, which will open sometime later this month. Thanks, midget. I do love me some Taco Bell. The mayor of South Park states that last night's tremors and fires are under control and that hopefully schools and businesses can open again soon. It's horrible. You don't understand. The elves... They took the stick! And it's bullshit because that is totally cheating. We specifically said no trying to take the stick at night. Elves are dirty little liars and we have to lay waste to their entire base. You have some incredible ability to make friends quickly, Sir Douchebag. I'm sending you on a quest to go out into the lands of Zaron and recruit a whole nother faction to Koopa Keep. Find the goth kids and give them this letter. Get them to join our kingdom and we shall lay waste to the drow elves once and for all. Fucking cheaters. <laughs> So it looks like the elves have took back the stick, or taken back the stick, I guess the correct words would be there. But first, before we recruit the goth kids, we have a date with Man Bear Pig. Hey Princess Keeney, are you uh, following me along here? Yes you are, I got my allies back. Ally with the goths, talk to the goth kids. That is something we will be doing in the future. Oh, this is cool all this stuff's all in town here, so I'm gonna head down to Cartman's and see if I can buy some cool stuff in his backyard. Let's talk to my good friend Craig here. The Grand Wizard said that I'm in charge of the shop now because I sound like Clyde. I don't sound like Clyde. Anyways, welcome, weary traveler. Would you like to see my wares? I would. You do sound like Clyde, by the way, bro. All right, weapons. Look at this. A legendary blade of a big bone Somali pirate king. See, this is nice. And it also brings in additional money, which is something I would rather have more damage for. But they're saying it's currently better than what I have, so we're going to grab it. Consumables are something that's really important for me. I want to make sure I have enough health potions at all time. So I'm going to grab as many health potions small as I can get, and I'm going to grab even a large or two. Eh, make it three. Or four. We got enough money. And uh, mana potions. We already have four, but I'll grab some more. Let's get the big one. We're really spending a lot of stuff here. Revive potion. That would have been nice if I had a friend to fight with last battle. Oh, a strength potion. Weight gain 4,000. That's funny. All right, increases your attack and defense. That's something I really need to look into more, using an item on each turn if I have enough money to buy enough items. I'm actually going to buy a few of these. They're $2. I know I'm wasting a lot of money here, but I think it's worth it. Equipment. KKK armor. Wow. All right. Um, Not sure... I'm not even going to wear that, even if it is better than what I have. Because it's not the best message. Selling my junk, selling my junk, selling, selling, selling my junk. So already up to $82 again, so that's really good. Now, if we were to sell some of my weapons I no longer need, like the Club of Smiting. So that puts us over $100 now. Now, this one attacks three times at the max of 67. This one attacks two times at 85 to 118. And you get money from it, so let's... Equip this. We're going to put on a modifier. I'll pick the best one here. I'm going to go with the add 15 shock damage on a perfect attack. And now I'm pretty happy with what I have. Look at that shock on my on my little sword there. That is very nice. I like all the little colors on the edge of it too. Let's go. Oh, there's, there's just some stuff lying here. Sweet. I like that. Now when it comes to Man Bear Pig, we have to help Al Gore find Man Bear Pig in South Park. So we need to attach Man Bear Pig sensors to an electric transformer... We also need to attach one to a fire danger meter and a wind cockerel. So, we will go to this. Actually, we'll go over to the map here, and we need to find all the areas in which Al Gore wants us to help him at. And, ooh, first try. We got one right outside of Keeney's house. So we're going to head down there, and 
important. Man Bear Pig's also up at the farm, which is something we haven't done yet. Head up to the farm, and I think I saw one out this way when I was looking before. Yes, this is the one at the fire danger meter out at Stark's Pond. So that's a lot of traveling. It looks like we're at all different corners of the map. If you even consider this a corner, it's not a corner, Speedy. You're an idiot. But we are really close to Keeney's house, so we're going to head over to Keeney first, and I will catch you guys over there. Also, guys, I would like to point out, while we're walking over here, there's a Chin Pokemon right outside the final battle of last episode on the TV screen, and I completely missed it, but, oh my god, as I was saying that, look at this. Let's grab this, and... This allows me to grab a little Chin Pokemon! Alright, I'm happy about that. I'm not sure if I'm going to be getting many Chin Pokemon, especially since I seem to be missing most of them, but that is a good find for me. Now, where is the fire danger meter here? There's that hobo that Jehovah told me to stay away from because he had 400 HP. 400 HP isn't much now. You know what? I see something behind the house there, and that might be something that is the fire danger meter. I bet that's probably what it is, and you have to fight the hobo to get to it. Yeah, we're just going to fight the hobo. He only has 400 HP, according to Jehovah. We are way past the point that that is threatening to us. So let's do this. Hey, this is my spot! 906. It goes up as you level, I guess. So everything's based on your level. So that's cool. Ow! Hmm. He is not affected too much by that. So we are going to use Princess Kenny summons a magical unicorn to trample on a row of enemies. Oh my, he levels up his shit too. Press the button shown. I'm bad at this. All right. Where are the buttons at? This is amazing. This is amazing. Why? Dang it! Oh! oh. Ah. I lost Keeney. Ah. Dang, that's hey. difficult. Okay, so Kenny's one of his abilities is to not stay dead long. So that's good. Ooh, look how much more HP I have, too. Let's Just see if he is weak to this. He's weak to electricity, so let's go with this. What I do? Oh, come on. All right. And let's try this one again. That's not there we nice. go. And here comes Keeney. He's back in the battle. So, Kenny... I would like to try that again, now that I know when it's coming up. Because I want to see what that does on a perfect attack. So let's find a PP up here. Power Potion. Restores 10 HP, which still will not allow me to do it. So maybe next turn I will have enough. Or will it? Is it 14 or 16? Hold on. Abilities. 14! We can do it! Let's go! Press the button shown. Let's do it. This looks amazing. I spent so much time on this. Hey! Why? I hit the wrong button! No! Up, huh? I will get that sometime, guys. I'm really bad at, like, quick thinking. It's not good. Yeah. I apologize. Ooh. I know you guys wanted to see that. And... Abilities. Let's go with this one. Let's try this again. Hold A until you're seeing red. Hopefully, I can do it this time. Ah. Was that good? I'm not sure. Oh, what the heck? Oh, come on. I got more health now. What I do? He only takes one damage to that? Is, am I seeing that right? That's not nice. All right, we got Kenny back. I would like to heal up though, but it will not allow me to do that unless can I? I can heal me during that turn. So that's sweet throw that over to myself, heal up. I just don't want to lose to a crazy hobo. And let's... Is Kenny Bow good on him? Maybe. Hey! There we go. And let's use this. Oh, come on! Why does it only say one when I hit him? Okay. Now... Let's do some farting. That's not nice. He's grossed out. Almost dead on him. 
Let's use... I don't have any abilities left of him, so we're just going to be using the bow. Hey, each time I see it. What I Perfect. Do? Noise. Play and off? better. Wow. This is hard to kill. There we go. Now, is this where the fire danger meter is? No, that's just a chest. Shit stained badge, that's great. Oh! Maybe on top of the roof there. You guys see that? Look at this. I think I need to get on the roof here. Now, does this ladder work? There we go, I bet it's on the roof. Kenny's Bloody Club. Pretty low level weapon there. There we go, item removed. Man Bear Pig Sensor. So I have two more left as I place down one. So we need to head over to the farm is where we'll go next because it's right above me. And I will see you guys over there. Also, I didn't need to even fight the hobo. <laughs> this is all new area for me now. Wait, I see a little kid back here. Billy tried to steal my hidey spot, but I made him go away. Oh, so that's sort of a side quest, but you just randomly find them all, so that's cool. I don't know if you guys remember, I think episode two, I believe, I talked to the children, and uh, we're supposed to find them, and uh, it's one of the side quests to find them all, so that's pretty cool. Oh, there's a hobo. Will you be my I'll friend? I'll give you a good prize. Oh, what does he have? I'm not sure if these prices are any better. I'll have to compare them. I don't think they are on first glance, but I'm not sure. Alright, can we talk to the cows? Aw, oh, I feel bad. <laughs> it's, uh, look at the little sign back there. It says, do it yourself veal. It's, uh, referencing that veal episode that was really funny. Do you talk to me? Oh, there's a children! I ain't a child. <laughs> oh, you founded me! That's awesome. I'm finding all these guys in one episode. I wonder what we get if we find them all. Alright, let's head through this way. Object required barn key. Oh, the wind cockerel's on top of the entire building up there, so let's see if we can hop up in here. And up in here? Is there a way to go up faster on the ladder? I guess not. And so that is great, which means we now have one more to do at Stark's Pond, and then I guess we'll go back and visit Al Gore. I'm not sure what they're going to want from us, but I will see you guys all the way over by Stark's Pond, which is going to be quite the journey. Oh, I can go in here. Do you talk to me? Oh. Oh, crap. God dang it, I didn't want to battle him. Oh, my. All right. This is another can hobo. Me? Oh, he only has 200 and... He doesn't have too much HP. Oh. We got two mice to fight with him, though. So let's go with this, and that will allow us to attack both of these at the same time, I believe. Or just one of them. Alright, that's great. Let's take out this little guy while we're here. Sorry, little buddy. You were cute. You're dead now. That was not that great. Block a little mouse attack, but Kenny already died? Oh my, that was bad. Bad sequence of events there. Sorry, little mouse. It's okay, buddy. Yeah. It'll always be for remembered. Ooh. Oh! I thought he was going to attack me some more there. So is he affected much by this? So let's go with A, Ooh. and then X. Yeah! There's treasure up at the top of this uh, U-Store boat. This U-Store car, so I want to make sure I get some of that. Let's do it. I know he's almost dead, but I really want to get this done for you guys. He frolics along. A. And... B. And... A. Yes! 251 damage. That's what's up. So you still get to attack him, it's just Kenny doesn't die. So that's actually quite risky. You lose Kenny if... Uh, you don't get it right. I'm full on those, so I can't get a free one there. Let's head up here. What might be in the use store at truck? Yellow, nothing great. That's that's fun. I thought there'd be something special in there since I didn't even think I could get in there and all of a sudden I hop up on some stuff and I'm in. So how do I, do I go behind it? 
Oh, that's how I get around here. I probably did that the first time I came in here. I'm stupid. All right, I'll see you guys over there. I can fast travel all the way to the school, so that is perfect. Let's head on up to Stark's Pond. I believe it was a fire danger meter that we needed to attach. Ooh, that's probably that right there. Is it? There we go. All three of my man bear pig things have been done. Now what do I need to do? Objective complete, place center, return to Al Gore. All right, I will see you guys all the way back over at Al... Wait, what was that? A chin po... Oh, no. It's actually a alien probe. Oh, and there's a chin Pokemon down there. That is awesome. Circuit patch. I can't use that yet, but I'm sure I'm assuming that's going to be pretty nice. Uh, only 10% more shock damage, but you know, it never hurts. And put ourselves back over here. Also, I just saw some treasure right here. Yes, I did. Let's grab these. And is there anything else? No, that's just the edge of the map, I believe. That's cool. I'm glad I saw that. What's over this way? Anything special behind here? No. Just a random path. Although there's probably a chin... Oh, no. I found a little kid, and I found some treasure. Found three kids this episode. I am proud of myself. This place is dark and scary. What if you never found me? You would have died. A really painful death. Sorry if I'm missing some chin Pokemon. I, it's not the biggest deal in the world. I'm never going to collect them all, but I will try to get as many as I can for you guys, okay? And Timmy's fast travel. And Al Gore is over... He's right behind these bushes here. What's the closest one to him? I'm assuming... We'll just go with this one. And we are here. And I can't stress enough how important it is that we do man bear pig pass for Al Gore because he does not have any friends except for me. I'm his only friend on Facebook, so let's go talk to him. Good job, Junior Al Gorian. With all the sensors in place, I can get a reading on my... <gasps> I knew it! These are definitely hot man bear pig readings. Come with me. I must put this data in the data man bear pig base. Where did he go now? I got Al Gore's storage key. Go to Al Gore's base. So let's find that on the map and figure out where we need to head. Oh, it's right down the road for us. His base is at the U store. That is really sad. All right, let's go over there. By the way, guys, if you hit RB here, it shows you where all the treasure is on the map. So that's pretty cool. It's not that treasure's that important because, I don't know, there's never too much good stuff in the treasure, but that's fine. So we are going to go over to Al Gore. All right, Al Gore. How do I get to Al Gore in there? Unless his base isn't inside there. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Look at this. Let's grab this. I can't reach it. Can I get up on there? Now can I reach it? Yes, I can. Al Gore better be up here. I took three seconds to figure that out. I better be rewarded. Can I talk to the kitty? Oh, I feel terrible. Let's just forget about that. And now I can hop into the used store. Okay, cool. Glad I figured that out. That could have been one of those things where I sat here forever and tried to figure it out. Actually, is he in here? Or is he back in the storage? I've got something in my front pocket for you. Nothing important in there unless... Nope, can't go this way. Alright, that was a waste of time. We will head back this way and hopefully find Al Gore. He gave me a storage key, so obviously it's back here. I'm stupid. Ooh, this one opens. Uh huh. Hmm. This is very interesting. The sensors have picked up Man Bear Pig underneath the ground of South Park. If you know anywhere you can get underground, go there at once and run this defilibrator. Defilibrator? <laughs> oh, Al Gore. Back again, Junior Al Gorian? Have you found somewhere in the sewers to put the defilibrator? The sewers, okay. Actually, there might be some cool stuff in here first. I bet there's a chin Pokemon hiding in here. Super secret keep out. I got stuck on some books there. Oh, requires Al Gore's secret room key. Which I bet is just hanging around somewhere. Can I find that real quick? Alright, I can't find his key, so I'm assuming that, that is where we will go when we get back here. Maggie's story key is required for that one, and Chaos Lair key. So it looks like Professor Chaos is going to come into play in this game. And there's some treasure up there. Do you guys see that? I'm not sure how to get to that. 
So yeah, let's look at the quest log here and see where we need to go to find the sewers. Man bear pig, right here in the middle of the town. And it looks like that is where we'll find the sewers. So I will see you guys over there. Fast travel! I want to fast travel across the land. Shippity doo bop, whippity woo wop, and heading over to the sewers. Photo dojo. Out of my way! Shut up, you look like a woman. Looky what we got here, guys. That will put me to here. This will put me up here. And we got myself some treasure. Squire gloves. That's what I want, a level 6 glove. That is nice. Adds 3 armor, reducing enemy attacks, and 10% damage when blocking. Alright. Take off. I will put them on right when I get back to... <laughs> Look at that, there's a Taco Bell coming soon sign up on the thing. That's, that's awesome. I like how the people in South Park just don't even... Figure it out. Oh, why, while we're here, look at this. Treasure! Can't take that, because I'm full. Probably shouldn't have bought all those. I should probably always, like, have eight of something, just so if I find something, I can get it for free instead of wasting $5 on that. Let's go in here and put on my new gloves. Level 6 gloves are way better than what we have now, I believe. Yeah, they add three armor. That's nice. I like three armor, but they don't look as cool. But that's fine. They kind of match my hoodie. So the sewers. Where can we enter the sewer at? Will you talk to me? You must be in our little Bradley's class. There we go. I know New everyone friend. thinks their child is special, but I really think he is. Let's go back here and grab this. I see I the saw sewers, two rats by the way. Running around last time I was at Skater's Bar. I'll probably still eat there. Oh, will this guy be my friend? No, he will not. All right. And back over here. We got men working down here. Oh, there's one of the kids hiding. And A? Puma told me to pick that spot. Pretty good, huh? Not really. Actually, was well, pretty good, actually. I'll give him that. Let's grab our alien probe. Grab this and plop down over here. Hit A on the treasure. Bruno Mars style. Level 8 Valkyrie patch. That's probably good. So we'll take it. And let's get this out of the way. And head down into here. Because we got a date with Man Bear Pig. Hmm. Already I see something I can hit with my gun. That turns that off. Oh, just for a little bit of time. Or is it pulsated? Uh, Kenny, don't get stuck. Good girl. It's funny, because he's a girl, and I get to say that. What's this do now? Completely turn it off? Nice. Right. <laughs> Item removed. So that's good. We've done what we needed to do, and... What just happened? I was looking up at the top left of the screen. Did I get fought by, like, a cat? Oh my god, it's like a super rat. A mutant rat. It's eradicate. Oh. I couldn't block that. And can I block this one? <laughs> Blocked you. It still did 65 damage. Kenny's almost dead. All right. Let's go for the big guy first. Just to get him out of the way. I feel like he can do a lot of damage. <laughs> He's almost dead. If I can take him out with Kenny real quick, I don't care. Actually, I do care if I lose Kenny. So let's do a health potion large. We got tons of them. Grossed out can't consume food. That's what happens when you're gross. That's not good. Fuck it. I'll just fight then. <laughs> I don't care if Kenny dies. He dies like 20 times each battle. And rat's dead, but I can't move my attacks to other people. I wish I could. And block that, and block that, so... We'll take out you. You dead as hell! There we go. Blocked you. Hit him back. Now, if we can just get one more attack on him, we should be good to go. Beautiful. Quick battle. I like that. Hmm... Is there anything else to explore down here? I guess this is something I can explore at a later date. Yeah, we might come back to the sewers. Right now, I just want to get my man bear pig on, you know? 
Oh, I forgot to loot them. By the way, if you kill people and you don't come back, and you leave the screen and come back and you don't loot them originally, their stuff turns into little things of gold. So if you do forget to loot people, you can come back and get it later, I believe. I'm not sure how long it stays there, but you know what? We'll figure that out. We're learning here. On my way up to Al Gore's place, I got in a little battle here, so I already hit the wrong button. Oh, I just killed Kenny. <laughs> All right. I'll see you guys after this battle. There's two people on top of the used store building. And actually, you know what? I won't see you out the battle. I just need to do one more attack on this guy. And I will have him completely taken out, so I will not be doing the skip. While we're finishing this battle, I just want to voice some of my opinions on this game. I think it's good so far, and I should say it's excellent so far. It's just this mission, I'm not really feeling it. Oh, I should probably lose these guys. I'm not really feeling this mission too much. It's to, to this point, it might get better, but to this point, it's just been a bunch of go over here, do this, go over here, do that, maybe fight some guy over here, and uh, I'm not really liking that style of gameplay. I understand it. It's a really good thing to do in terms of like making your game deeper, but I'm not really liking that aspect right now. But let's hopefully get to see some man bear pigs sometime soon here. Let's go inside. I did it, Al Gore. Nice work. I will let you know of any updates on Manbear Peg. Make sure to share the news on Facebook. I'm super serial. Oh, so that was the entire quest. All right, well, there's going to be more with Manbear Pig. I'm a little disappointed. Like I said, that's kind of sad that that's... I still can't get an Al Gore's secret room. That's something we'll probably be doing at a later day of the game. If you guys aren't familiar with Manbear Pig, I would head to South Park Studios and watch that website. Uh, I'm not I'm not endorsed by South Park Studios. It's just a place where you can watch all the episodes online. And that's where I used to watch my episodes that I used to watch. So just letting you guys know there's places you can watch them online for free. And I thought I'd share that information with you guys. But I think that's going to be the end of the episode. I will see you guys next episode. We're going to get back onto the main quest because we got ourselves a date with the Taco Bell aliens. Which aren't actually affiliated with Taco Bell. So I will see you guys next time. Thank you for watching and have a great day.